بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم والصلاة والسلام على أشرف المرسلين سيدنا محمد وعلى آله وصحبه أجمعين دمان داودي أشقي مها يقايها لأن قد داوني التلفزيون كوين كلسن وحان لنا هبين وناكسن عاوة أو أحادة وحان سيدا نغبرتين هل كان إذن كيغسو ديننا برنامج كي قرمت برنامج كاسي أو سيدا عادة دا إنو آ آن کو خدا دیگر قرمز ها برشده دقلها سیاستا حبرشده یا قیسیس که لسه جد بنا ده سومالی دکنال دلکن یا مالک ال دوون و دنیا تعلق ده برنامج ک عاوا و حن نصیب ویل نی و اینو گو مرتیه تو کی مقاله ده هانیش لو اهره سر مرکز نه سیاسی معناها رج عداء كان ترسان سياسيين تاوى وين حزبيغا شقالها اللو يقانو الليبر بارتيغا كان صلا نيسار مالك وحاكالي او عوضا انو فردي هالكن او مرتي انو غوة برنامجكن Head of Residents and Business Association South Hall Broadway نيكا يساقو مدحضوة معناها او رضا قناع ستادا هي دادكا ديگانكا ديگن لو يقانو ساعت هول بروروي اولي را برادر بانگو وحا موضوع عني او كو ساب سنية هاي ليبر بارتي گا اما حس بيگا شقالها ساقو هادا معارض کا ايو عرمها على حريرا حس بيگا سي هي دادكا ايو تاگيرا سياسة دهان محلياً هذا نقول له دعانا ذا مركا لندن أمبا جوال أهان أمبا قرن أهان برنامج كا وحكو بحضنا لقد إنجليزي جا أيضا أيدنا عصعت ترجمات وحنا دوينها سينينا فرصة أي نقل قيب قاتان بنك تلفون كا first of all I have to welcome you to the program of Kelson good evening good evening I welcome you warmly Councillor Nizar Malik thank you. to Kelsen TV uh, and I would like to thank you for accepting our invitation uh, to personally appear here and answer the questions regarding Labour Party, regional, local and national issues. Mm -hmm. I also would like to say thank you uh, Brother Bangu, uh, the head of South Hall Broadway Business and Resident Associations a man of a very long experience in, in the field that he's working and would like to say to you both of you, uh, you are uh, more than welcome here. Uh, tonight we will be uh, discussing uh, the Labour Party and issues related to it. The Labour Party is a political party in United Kingdom uh, that has been established in the 19th century. The Labour has been described as ideologically party for the poor and people who have been disadvantaged by their wealth or uh, many consider by their origins faith. It is party for uh, many people it was founded in 1900. The Labour overtook Liberal Party as the main opposition to the Conservative in the early 1920s, forming minority government under Ramsay MacDonald in 1924 and from 1929 to 1931. Labour later served in the wartime coalition from 1940 to 1945 after which it formed a majority government under uh, Clement Attlee. Labour was also in government from 1964 to 1970 under Harold Wilson and from 1974 to 1979 under Wilson and then James Callaghan. The Labour Party was last in the government uh, from 1997 to 2010 under Tony Blair and Gordon Brown, beginning with a, with a landslide majority of 79 reduced to 167 in 2001 and 66 in 2005. 
having won 232 seats in the 2015 general elections, the party is the official opposition in the Parliament of United Kingdom. The Labour is the largest party in the Welsh Assembly, the third largest party in the Scottish Parliament, and has 20 MPs in the European Parliament, sitting in the Socialist and Democratic groups. This big party with this long history is now seen a party that is struggling. You are one of those respected politicians locally and regionally, and you have served your people through this party. Yes. Uh, our first question is, what is the Labour Party's current situation in terms of leadership, trust and capacity? Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. First of all, can I just say a thank you to you and to your audience uh, for watching us and giving us the opportunity to put our views to them. Uh, thank you. We, as the Labour Party, as far as the leadership is concerned, yeah. there's two things which are very, very important to remember. Uh, and now I'm talking about perception. Perceptions, what people perceive. Mm -hmm. That in the case of Germany Corbyn, I really feel very sad to see that a person who has been elected by the member of the Labour Party should have been accepted by the sitting majority MPs uh, he won uh, by taking one of the biggest majorities. Uh, I think they all should have supported him. And instead, they worked, in my view, and in the perception of people, uh, against him, where they actually would not even join uh, the shadow cabinet. So the poor man started off a very disadvantage. Yeah. Uh, now, then he was forced into another selection, yeah. which, in my view, did a great deal of damage yeah. to the Labour Party. Uh, in fighting, it doesn't win the election. Mm -hmm. And to actually win the election, people need to see the leader as a, a strong person. And not force him into another selection. Not force him to another selection, but yeah. he was forced into it. Mm -hmm. He had no choice. Yeah. Uh, and therefore, he was perceived to be a quite a weak person. Yes. Uh, now, it doesn't mean the person who is perceived to be a weak mm -hmm. will not deliver the policies, mm -hmm. not deliver what people want. He's probably got heart of gold and he's probably one of the best person you can come across, mm -hmm. but he doesn't give that impression. Yes. And that has been the problem. Mm -hmm. uh, and that actually has divided mm -hmm. the Labour Party. Mm -hmm. And divided parties can never win election. Yeah. And that is where the problem lies, in my personal view. Uh, and I, I hope that uh, people will see that uh, uh, generally as well. Uh, but I think mm -hmm. Labour Party, mm -hmm. as you said, the Labour Party is for the poor people. Yeah. Labour Party still is relevant as it was when it first started. In the 1900s. In the 1900s. Mm -hmm. And Labour Party has achieved for the poor people so much, mm -hmm. so much what we enjoy today. Yeah. And I'm proud to be connected with the Labour Party. Yes. Uh, I cannot be proud time to time some of our uh, maybe leaders or maybe some of the people who are actually representing us, but mm -hmm. Labour Party doesn't belong to one person. Mm -hmm. It belongs to all of us. Yes. And we need to make sure mm -hmm. that we get the right people coming in. Definitely. Thank you very much. Now, I will say that the President of the Labour Party is the President of the Labour Party. 
iyo arimaha khuseeya haday noqon lahayd arimaha ka dhacaya meelaha aan degenahay ama gobol ahaan ama wadanka waxa ay noogu martay ahaa barnaamijka wiilina nala fadhiya ee kansala nisaar maalik oo aad u qiimo magaalada honislow ahna siyaasi kamida siyaasiinta labourka ahna kansalar ka soo jeeda dhulka ee markii aan weydiiyay su'aashi aad maqleysan oo ah ee labour party xaaladiisa hadda halkay taagan tahay marka la fiiriyo xaga leadership ka hoggaanka iyo dadka iskalsoonida ay ku qabaan iyo awoodiisa waxa uu kansalar maalik ku jawaabay marka aan eegno leadership ka waxa jira in waxaan ka hadlaya u yiri laba shay waxaan ka hadlaya perception ka waxa qofku oo perceived ah i'tiqaadka uu rumaysan yahay marka aan fiiriyo marka jeremy ninka leader ka ah ama hoggaamiye oo xisbigani waxaan leeyahay aad baan uga tiraanyooday ee macnaha in la doorto ninkaasi asagoo la doorto waxay ahayd in sida loo doortay loo aamino oo loo taageero لكن wuxuu yiri dadkii doortay ba qaarkood ka hortageen oo ka soo horjeestay ninka miskiinka ayuu yiri waxa uu ku bilaabay hoggaankiisa mid iyo markaasi dhibaataysan ayay ahayd waxa lagu khasbay marka selection kala ayaa lagu khasbay in dib hadana loo soo doorto doorto ee waxana loo arkay oo dadku arkeen inuu yahay qof weak person qof ضعيف ee in kasto oo aanay taasi ayaa marka sabab u noqotay in xisbigii shaqaalaha ee xoog galaha uu kala qaybsamo ee waxa uu yiri raayigaygu wuxuu yahay yiri nisaar maalik xisbi kala qaybsamay ma uu guuleysto ee waxaan qabaab u yiri labor party ga ama xisbiga shaqaaluhu inuu yahay xisbi isagu taagan dadka fuqarada ah wiilina uu yahay wax badan waa ay gaareen walaalayaal barnaamijka waxa ay din furan yahay Okay, I'd like to thank you uh, for the uh, clear explanation of what perception is and a lot of us suffer from not what they personally do but who they are or what others have been perceived of them. Yeah. I think he, uh, the, the capable man has been perceived as weak and it is due to the infighters and people who are against him. I and many others generally free from the influence of any one. We totally agree that the man who has been chosen should have been supported, supported. and not forced into another selection. So the inf I totally agree the infighters uh, uh, cannot divide it. You are weak, united we remain strong so Absolutely. the party's weakness uh, stems from this uh, i wanted to uh, tell you one thing yeah uh, there is the this has led to a situation where in scotland for example there is a rise of nationalism mm -hmm. a lot of people are today in favor of policies and programs uh, to cut Scotland from the rest of the United Kingdom. Mm. And the rest are unionists. The unionists vote those, who, those people in Scotland who are <coughs> in favor of staying in Britain, who strongly believe that their lives are better th I to remain in uh, the union, their voters have gone to the conservative. So the Labour have been deserted in that part. There is a split in uh, Wales. I think he, you have got reducive majority in some areas. Uh, and you also have uh, the devastating result of by-elections in Copland, where the Labour has lost uh, completely uh, it is cities in that region. Okay, if you look at Gary Snell, on the Stoke and Trent, the by-election, the majority has been reduced, the, the labors. These kind of things, is there a demographic change or it is as a result of people seeing the divided party? Well, as I said before, mm -hmm. it, is, it is a divided party, uh, whether we accept it or not, mm -hmm. that's, that's, that's our opinion. But I say to the voters, mm -hmm. Labour Party is 
still mm -hmm. the right party to vote for mm -hmm. because you look at the things which are actually people are suffering from mm -hmm. the national health yeah. the education the housing all of these are major issues and the Labour Party has been at the forefront to resolve those issues. It is the Conservative parties who's actually not building any housing, mm -hmm. not giving enough money to the national health to run. Mm -hmm. Cuts and cuts and cuts. I'll give you an example. Capital, uh, the taxation mm -hmm. on corporation tax. Yes. In developing world, mm -hmm. on average, is 37% yes. of corporation tax. Yes. The UK at the moment is just over 25%. Mm -hmm. Now, if you look at the gap, just the 1% mm -hmm. makes a difference, almost 6 to 7 billion pounds. Yeah. Now, if you are actually not collecting the taxation which is actually runs the services, mm -hmm. the hospital, yes. the schools, mm -hmm. uh, the old people homes, mm -hmm. um, the libraries and, you know, you the facilities. Yeah. Essential, mm -hmm. in my view, that everything connects with each other mm -hmm. and the money is not being collected enough mm -hmm. to pay for those services. Mm -hmm. In fact, that money is going into the corporation's pockets mm -hmm. and the they're wealthy and the rich. They're yeah. getting away with it. Yeah, definitely. All right? Yeah. I mean, this is what the problem the Labour Party has to fight mm -hmm. with a new leader mm -hmm. or a sitting leader, whatever happens. Mm -hmm. That's up to the Labour Party to decide after the election how the result come out. Yes, thank you very much. Uh, you, you are saying that the Labour Party is, is still uh, the right uh, party Absolutely. for the poor and the underclass to vote for? Absolutely. Okay. Uh, in terms of the health, education and housing, you mentioned an important uh, comment you made that the, the, the Labour Party is, is the one who is fighting for these important issues. Uh, they are build the, the, the current party, the Conservatives, are not building enough houses. They are cutting and cutting, and in terms of collecting the vital tax corporation, where you gave examples in developing world, 35 percentage uh, uh, of this is collected. Where in UK, with everything uh, in, in improve it and 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 manage it, 25 percentage is a bit unacceptable. Meaning you will not have opportunity to to run the services without good collection of corporation tax. Absolutely. Okay. Well, just the, uh, there are things here. In terms of the health, education, and housing, yeah. uh, in terms of housing, uh, we have witnessed 50,000 households, uh, families, shipped out of London during the, uh, the term or uh, the period of Boris Johnson, when he was the mayor of London. We have witnessed it, massive, uh, so-called, uh, what, what is called it, ethnic cleansing. Yeah. Uh, the, the cities have seen a departure of large number of poor families, relocated, f cut off from the environment in which they were working, the local connections, friends. the friends, relatives, the, the world they have made and thrown into an unknown. I think uh, the, the, the impact, the psychological and uh, you know, economic impact on these families is unbelievable. You, we have seen families removed from uh, West London uh, boroughs and thrown out, by academically performing very poor, uh, people picking up uh, mental illnesses. All this was done during that. Uh, the, the new mayor, Sadiq Khan, has promised that he would build 50,000 homes. And down, uh, not far from where I, I live, in Acton, the conversion of the town hall into apartments is one of the mayor's projects. So I think it's a good thing.
what a lot of people are saying, Nizar Malik, even though I have a total respect for you and the work you are doing for the community and the party, a lot of people are saying we are suffering hugely in areas where labor has dominations, where la uh, labor co has full, is in full control of the situation, like Ealing, Brent, <coughs> Hillingdon, uh, uh, if you look at uh, Hammersmith, all these areas are areas where you have a high concentration of poor working class and the housing situation is very poor. <coughs> How can you convince the, the voter that if you are uh, elected, uh, you would improve their lives when now you haven't done anything for them? Let me begin by uh, telling people that if the local council mm -hmm. is restricted to spend the money or collect the money mm -hmm. and you are in a straight jacket, yeah. how are you going to improve people's situation, yeah. the housing, if you are given, if, you're, if you don't reduce a budget, mm -hmm. I mean, I'll give you an example of Hounslow. Yes. We've been reducing money for the last, since 2010. Mm -hmm. Okay? No, sorry, 2006. Beg your pardon. Mm -hmm. Since 2006, mm -hmm. we've been reducing money. Mm -hmm. Now, it's been 10 years. Mm -hmm. Every year, we've been told to cut, cut, and cut, and cut. If you don't, mm -hmm. they will appoint mm -hmm. somebody to run the borough. Mm -hmm. Okay? Yeah. So if you are actually given that choice mm -hmm. that you lose control of the borough, mm -hmm. if you go, if you don't cut what they ask you to cut, mm -hmm. what, what, can, what can the councils do? What the Labour councils can do? Mm -hmm. We have to live within the budget they provide. Mm -hmm. they, the, all the money, most of the money goes to the central government. Yes. The taxation and all the rest of it, the council tax and all of that, mm -hmm. and then they distribute it. Mm -hmm. So it's up to them what they want to give you. So no matter whether the the the, the party in power is Labour, it is the 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 party it's who the controls the government to decide is the fate of the people. Absolutely. Definitely. And then if you want to increase mm -hmm. the your council tax, mm -hmm. you cannot increase more than two or three percent to four percent. And that's it. And if you do that, then obviously the voters are going to be after you. Mm -hmm. That why are you increasing the council tax? Yeah. So we are in a catch twenty two. Yeah. Because if we increase the council tax to to to, to be able to have <laughs> money to, to help the people to help the people yeah. to provide the services, people will go against you. Exactly. They will say, "Hang on, the, the Labour government is actually giving us more council tax." Definitely. But we don't. We we can't do anything about it. Yes. I well, I will say Allah SWT, interesting debate, Councillor Nizar Malik, I am with the Sual Muhima, or a Wahuri and Waha in Suashu Wahaya had and my Wahanka had Lene Partigani, the Vatasan, Makolata Hai in Wakavana, Merka, Wahuri and his beginning, where his be a Tahai Willi in an Alu Odeno, Wahajira. Arimaha Afima at Kaparashari Housing and Kahadalni and Labour Ku Mai is bigger Hadijira Mudisayo Gurioko Filan and Marka Manaso Arurina Wahan Lira Corporation Taxka or Ganasiga Laga Adaka Ganasta in Malkavanka Laga Arurio. What the mother so Korea Alamutalitka Wahas Elahada Bokolki was of the nation Halkani Bokolki will attend Shan and Shurta Sia so Aruta. Marka and Shurti Laduni in Lakan, Lagaka, that Kayu Wahai staff, Manaha, Ganasa, Tada, where we, and Mae Imaniso. Marka, Waha, a Tahai, the Bata, the Mesha, say Kaymanisa, Wahan we de Wahasoka Tsale in Waktigi Mayor Ki Bruce Johnson. Conton Kun of Famil, Lagat Behi, Magalu, Yinko, or Lu, Daddy, Manaha, Mela Fog, or that Kasi, a Lumian. Dulalki Eko Koran, Meli Hakka Baranayin, Shakuin Kudi, Karkod, Udroko Dain, Ilmihina, Ewaprashadi Hago, the Ego Kuanak, and I sped the Kai Gurgurid the Dip Kayimit. Marka Wahankuri, Hada in Waha at Kuba Deli San or at Samene San and Mahayato and Labour Party, Gumasal and Kasokat, 
مایر کسیدی خان و حبلان قاضی نکنتم کن گری دست دارم. هدایا مرکت سال و حاصل قاضی دگم دا اکتر و تان هول که دا اسمها کس عضا و مایر افس پروژت. آل ود است گری عصب. مرکا و حا آن وی دیه داد کو دیابت و حب کو قبان هد حق گری هم مرکلی را و آدلا و و نکسن نهی مالها لیبر کو کتنه. مرکا و حیری محی تلا دا تریسا. هذي أنا قال عكتي أي بحنا يعني كنترول يعني دولة دولة ده حا إلا الله بده كوني لحدي مركان سالو سقطوا يري هنزلو وحال جري إلا جري مدة طبعا سنة لعكتا دولة بحسو بعد جدك معناها دخ معناها ميزانية دينا لجري إلا جري هذي عنده معناه كونسل كدمعه إن أو ان کانسل تکس کداد که لگه قاضی کرد و دیگه سر عق مکان او ابرو داد که اکوکو کعیا حدی کلنا ایجی ان کسینه مرک محنا به مرش سکت تاگن تهی ان وحنا هدا اسو ورکسنی نه ولال کن ان صاحب کن او آ بانگو ایا محوی دینی نه سوال مهمه Good evening بانگو بانگو اجستی you have been head of uh, we, we started South of Broadway Residence and Broadway Association. Uh, association, you have been one of the, the reason, founders. Yes. The reason why that was was nobody, nobody was listening. Yes. We would go to meetings. Yes. They would take down like. notes. Mm -hmm. Our councillors then, three months later, mm -hmm. will say we are still waiting. Yes. What we find is, with all due respect to Mr. Malik, mm -hmm. the councillors really have no power. Mm -hmm. The power mm -hmm. is with the officers of mm -hmm. the departments. Mm -hmm. It is them who say yeah or nay, yes or no. Mm -hmm. So, councillors, I've been to town hall meetings mm -hmm. and I've seen the way the dis discussions have been taking place. Mm -hmm. And Hello. personally, I think it doesn't work mm -hmm. because you could have a very good, hard-working councillor. Mm -hmm. But yet, if all the other councillors do not agree, mm -hmm. nothing will happen. There is no motion passed. Mm -hmm. What we, when we opened or started our organisation, I would a few years ago, mm -hmm. and I would I would contact the council, mm -hmm. and especially with London Borough Ealing, because mm -hmm. I live in Southall, mm -hmm. you find that you are speaking to a receptionist on the phone. And if you ask, I would like to speak to the department, mm -hmm. oh no sir, I can't do this. I cannot put you directly in contact mm -hmm. with the department. Mm -hmm. And it must be very sad because people go to work and they mm -hmm. answer the phones and they must be very desperate people mm -hmm. who have issues, mm -hmm. housing, medical. Yeah. And you're not allowed to speak to anybody. Mm -hmm. Now so there is there is a culture of blocking, of course, people from speaking to the right people. That's correct. Yeah, they will and take a And you end up talking to the receptionist. Of course, and I feel sad <coughs> for them mm -hmm. because they get it in English. We say they get it in the neck every day okay. from the public. If I ask you, uh, you are a chair of the South of Broadway, and yes, South of Broadway South Business and yes, Resident Association. Yes. Yeah, what is the uh, aims and objectives, what do you have to achieve? We have to achieve, uh -huh. we want fairness uh -huh. for everybody. Yes. If you cannot speak to the people uh -huh. that we voted for, yes. then what is the use of us voting? Yes. Why should we vote? Yeah. That's my argument. Yes. If you go to a doctor, yeah. you tell him what is wrong with you, uh -huh. he gives you medicine. Uh -huh. We keep talking to a brick wall, yeah, and there's no results. So nobody is listening to what you're saying. That's correct. That's correct. We okay. For example, if I ask you a couple of issues in Sartol, there is a water side development. They are building three thousand five hundred flats. I have heard from people saying that nobody has contacted the residents. This is a major project. No consultations have been made. The, uh, uh, I think he and and there is the, uh, the, 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 the contractor's vehicles, uh, heavy vehicles have damaged properties and vehicles parked there. They will, they, 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 
they call you to a meeting yeah. and they lie to you. Mm -hmm. In 2010, we were told mm -hmm. that they will build a new road mm -hmm. from Hayes Bypass mm -hmm. into Waterside Development, which is the old gas works. Yeah. And this never happened. They said we will build a, a road bypass. A relief road. Yeah. So no trucks would be coming through Beaconsfield Road mm -hmm. or any of the roads off the south of Broadway mm -hmm. or South Road yeah. or over the station. Yeah. They didn't... That is they, false promise. They didn't... They promised us, but they did not keep the promise. Okay. Well, yes, Salah Sa'atan, we have a group of people who are in the middle of Bangu, Hawaii, Niki Sagu Malahdoa, and Uruka, Ile, Hindatka, Kunol, or Dagan Kasi, South of Broadway, Egan Asatadaba. We have a Kashe, Kay, or Siwina, or Maklesan, Haga, Lahadalka, Ealing Council. We have a Dunis of an Allah, so we have Magari, Yokofki, Adonis, or Kagu. وحجرات لقم باجرة أو آت كل ما نيسو وحكستو دوني سقف آن مرنبكو جد بني مركو حيلات هاي دبتوين كده كوا يكو قبان إيلين كانسل يا مالها كلا با وايل نلسو حريري كان عوضة I just wanted to ask you uh, one thing uh, uh, just in terms of complaining about the lack of communication you have you managed to reach out the the senior leadership in on the 22nd of July 2016, yeah. I contacted Mr. Julian Bell's office. Yeah, 2016. Of course. And that is the leader of the council. That's the leader of the council, uh, Mr. Julian Bell. Mm -hmm. You um, contacted him. I've, I've met him personally on a number of occasions. Mm -hmm. And till today, mm -hmm. I have received no response. From 2016, 2016 uh, December? No, J July, July, July. July. It's almost... Uh, a year, a year, nearly coming down is, to is, yes. Is a year. Now, nearly, yeah. now, the problem is this. Yeah, and it is electronic communication. Of course, that through his office. Through his office. Through his office. Mm -hmm. they Did you receive acknowledgement? Yes, but the issue has been completely ignored. Of course, because we are nobody. We are lambs. Okay. Leader of the council, Julian Bell, Lavadi Kun لحية تبانكي وحان نجد وحان هلاي وان هلاي وركاجي لكن واحدا بقى إلا صو هاد لي مجر وحان هاي مدري من بق. and مرك I just would like to say can I just answer the question on that one yeah definitely three thousand five hundred flats I've spoken to the contractor yes the contractor is called St James Berkeley Homes now they tell me roughly yes that the population is going to be increased mm -hmm. 14 to 20,000. Yeah, the reason of new South building is, is new to welcome the new, new people coming the into new, the area. The new development... Where are they coming from? You tell me. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we live there and yeah, no one's yeah. speaking to us. Yeah. The council, none of our councillors... Sazol is already overpopulated. It is very the, much. The roads are congested. Heavily. People room around hours to get no parking, place to park. No parking. And you are telling me the council is planning to bring 20, 20, 20, 20, 20 thousand people, people into South. Into South. And they're going to build three roads yeah. from Beaconsfield Road, that's yes. where South Oak College is. Yes. Into the new development. Yes. Those vehicles then are going to come on to Beaconsfield Road. Yes. Go to the Broadway mm -hmm. or go to South Road. Mm -hmm. So we are going to be living yeah. in very bad times very soon. Yeah, definitely. I think we will not be able to move our vehicles. Yes. It will be chaos. Yes. Can I ask you one thing? Uh, the, the additional people who are coming into already uh, overpopulated area, I think there is a lack of clear plan and of no regard for of the suffering of, of the already people. No. Can I ask you? Where these people would get uh, the services that are already overstretched? The schools, the hospitals. Ealing Hospital, the Ealing Hospital is definitely going to shut down. Yes. We we have got two hundred and seventy-five thousand signatures. Yeah. To save the hospital. Mm -hmm. But nobody again is listening. And the law says if you have got hundred thousand signatures to the parliament. Have you submitted to the parliament? We 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 asked we we. I'm sorry. We asked our MP yeah. to 
to stand up in Parliament. Okay. But instead, he, they went to a side room the, to, the, the to have a discussion. You have, sub <laughs> you, you have submitted through the MP. Yes, yes, yes. So we, 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 we got a side, in, side room, yeah. which I was ashamed to go to. Yeah. Because... But what, but what I heard, to, yeah. be, to yes. be fair mm. to uh, the MP, yeah. that the signatures you collected, mm -hmm. they were actually not all from this area. London Borough Wheeling, mm. sir. All of them? London Borough Wheeling. I thought they were nationwide. Well, well, we can look. That's not a problem. We can see. Yeah. But we've still got... Because in order, to d in order to debate in the House of Parliament... Mm -hmm. You need 100,000. You thousand. need 100,000. Yes, and you need it from the area definitely. where the issue is from. I but, sir, so we still had mm -hmm. 175,000 <laughs> okay. over uh, I have the 100,000. Yeah, definitely. Right. I think if these were genuine signatures, from the local people, I don't see any reason why it why shouldn't be. Yeah. yeah, yeah, I think it may be th there is an issue, or maybe it's not, but I think it, there is a anti, uh, what I call uh, anti labor le leadership sentiment developing as a result of these little things. They're not little. They're not little. It's, labor, yeah. it's for our life. It yeah, saves labor. lives. Hospital, <laughs> hospital saves yeah. lives. Yeah, Absolutely. Yeah. And if Ealing Hospital closes, yes. the nearest hospital is going to be Hillen Hospital yes. or Northwick Park. Okay. So, so we're we're either going to die waiting for an ambulance, yes. or we're going to die inside an ambulance, yes. or we're going to die in a corridor in a hospital. And I, sir, believe yes. that we deserve better. Okay. My parents came to this country, yes. they worked here yeah. for five pounds a week. And, uh, and you have lived and in, in the area 50 years. That's correct. And yeah. we've done the same. Yeah. And I am fighting mm -hmm. for those people mm -hmm. who are sitting at home mm -hmm. who are ill. Yeah, yeah, definitely. When they call an ambulance mm -hmm. and the ambulance says to you yeah. that it's 45 minutes, yeah. three, four weeks ago, mm -hmm. a little girl died. Mm -hmm. She is waiting for an ambulance for two hours. Okay. With blue lights. Uh, in the area? No, in London. In London, yeah. So yeah. is this what the future is going to be for us? Okay, definitely. Well, Ali Al Sautan, head of resident association, head of Marakti and businesses. I am a Joga Bangu, Waha Usi, Adagu, Raisi, Asadaha, Yakab Kaloma, Mulayo, Degan Kasi, Waha Yuri, Adi Allah Harir, Joab Kusin, Mayan, Salo, Usokata, Wakado Udre. جميعها كونسل كجوليان بيل لابد يكون يلحق تبانك أول يروان السوق على تلاك وحبل لقى قبل إن وحاو يشجعي إن لديسا يصدون يشنكون أو فلات ولأن اللي هي أفر يتبانكون أو روح أيها الكيني يا إيري هذا مركا وحولي هالكيل الكيني يا هالكيل لوج هلا يا سكولات يو سبيتالو إن معناها حالة دني وحالة حن وحن من س وحن استاهلنا وحن تاكبد مدو كلو حروحان اروري نيلا بقولي تضوات ان شن كن او صحيح او لو جود بيي معناها لغا سهور جدي اسبيتالات كلوشر اوف جيرين معناها ساوث هول هوسبيتال ايلينغ هوسبيتال ايلينغ هوسبيتال مركا وحو يري وح جواب ما هنا مركا تاسي وحا دعي كرتا انا جي كونسلر مالي وحن امن سنه هي شيء شرعي هذه بقول كن أو سيجنجر أجد بيسو إن أرن كاسي لقد دودي لكن وح كان صار كده واجي إن أشد أو مغلي قاركو دتك وحصوص هاي أين كإيمان دول كاب شو على هو فرنجين دمانتين وأنا قال قيب قارن دون تان كسر دواء خدك قف بخدك كجرا ولا سر دواء سر دواء ولا أسرع ولا ألو ها سلام عليكم ولا ما يعاني ما شك سهاد ليسو أميز عبد الله أحمد عبد الله أحمد يا يا محسن أبو جميل سالم we are living in Hackton yes oh yes جميل سالم is husband we welcome you gentlemen yeah we have a problem yes my kids will speak with you my English good can can you raise your voice please uh, hello? Yes, yes. Yeah, um, I'll speak on behalf of my parents. Yes, please, yeah. Yeah. Um, 
Uh, are you the right person to speak to her now? Yeah, yeah, we are uh, listening to you clearly. You can continue to speak, please. Okay, so um, it, so I, I live with my parents. I'm a student myself. So yeah. my parents, my mom is called Jamila, my dad's called Abdullah. Uh -huh. And um, it, it, uh, starting at September, you know, we, you guys are talking about uh, housing and how labor is actually going to be helping out uh, people just like us, you know, people in need, okay? Yeah. Um, you know, you, there's a lot of sentiment that labor is out to help and outreach, and we've really felt the impact of the housing crisis. Um, so since September, we've been... Can you uh, please, we have a, a little bit, uh, we need the voice to go up, please. Okay, so, so uh, as I was saying, um, we've been evicted from September, yeah, and uh, actually de December and um, uh, not September, December from last year, and we've been uh, moved from uh, first of all two um, travel lodges, and then we've moved into a bed and breakfast. Yeah, and uh, from the bed and breakfast, we've been here for almost five months. Yeah. Now they, when we were at the council first, we were promised almost ten weeks, and it sounded promising, but. The problem is, is that uh, we are now in a bed and breakfast for five months in um, Harrow, and we've been moved all the way from our home uh, borough, which is in Ealing. And uh, this, like as you can imagine, it causes a lot of problems in terms of schools for someone like me, who's a student. I'm studying A levels. Where? Where are you studying? I'm studying in a sixth form called Burlington Danes. The one in Shababush, close to the Hammersmith Hospital. And you come all the way from Harrow. I, I take a journey every morning. It's, it's a long distance. I switch from the Metropolitan Line all the way to Piccadilly Line. And then from Piccadilly Line, I take all the way to Acton. And from Acton, I catch a 70 bus to school. And it's a daily journey I have to make. And plus the delays, I'm usually, uh, I've got a lot of problems where I come late to school. And, you know, I don't really like creating a fuss. I don't like telling people that, you know what, uh, I'm always late and stuff like that, but what I'm trying to convey is the message is that, you know, it does really, this housing problem really creates a problem for people. As a student, for me, I've really felt the impact in terms of my studies. So Are you academic, really, academically weaker than you used to be? Well, definitely, right now, definitely. So What, what, what I, did your I, mom I, used to do? What, who, who used to, when you were living in Acton, before you were relocated, far away in Harrow, by Ealing Council, what mom or dad used to do? Well, my dad is, he's uh, got a medical condition and he can't really work, so my mom is the main supporter of the family. She has a, like, oh. a humble, small um, hairdresser, and she's also been finding it difficult since she now moved really far away, and she's, she's, uh, she's, she's uh, old herself, you know, but, you know, as a family, we need to do what we can to help each other. So my mom is really uh, finding it difficult to take care of my father and go to work at the same time before it used to be convenient. So the mom, the, sorry to interrupt you. The mom has to play two roles, to look after the ill dad and also to work in, in the area she used to live in Acton. Yeah. yeah, but now it's been even very difficult for her. I can remember the first month she used to really complain and she used to be in... A, a lot of distress because she's been finding it difficult to get to work and then come back and when my dad needs her and go back to work and it's it's very like hectic and it's been hectic for everyone my sister she's in her final year in uni okay. she's studying uh, she's studying to become a teacher you know so and uh, i think he, she's going to become a teacher yes uh, this is her final year in her uh, pgce and She's, she's been studying and I've also felt, I can, I can see my sister who's gone tired from all of this changement and, you know, moving from one travel lodge to another and moving down to this hostel, having problems with even the basics of having, like, internet access to actually do her work, do her emails, uh, get her lessons done for her students. And I, I think, did, you, did, you, did your mom or yourself or anybody from the family delegate their claims that their lives have been destroyed to the leaders of Ealing. Pardon? Have you complained to Ealing Council? You wouldn't believe we have complained to every person you, must, you know. 
every person we've we've called every person as possible our local mp our local councillor we've talked to the housing we've talked to everyone i complained i have i have complained to my school i have complained to uh, I've done. I've done what I can. I've completed. And, and you are the final year of A level. No, this is this is actually the f the first year of my A level. But it's really yeah, a defining moment because if I don't you know, get it, it's shameful. Because yeah, it's, it's shameful. shameful. Thank you very much. I think we would I love wanted, to hear I from you. I wanted you. to say to the young man. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, young brother, if you can hear me, yes. I feel sad for the predicament that you're in. Yeah, and. I would suggest, uh, did they give you any reason why you have to leave Acton to go to Harrow or Ealing no, and I then go I'll to Harrow? Yeah, I'll answer that directly. They, there was no reason, they didn't give us any reason why they were moving us from Ealing to Harrow. And this is what astonished me. It's like, it's, it's such a, a huge transfer from that area to here. Like, I, I feel like nobody here. And no, 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 no. you're not nobody, yeah. brother. You're a human being. I, I understand that, but where, you know when you move from your hometown where, where you know everyone, you where, walk in the street, you, you know everybody, but you're here, you don't know anybody. Were you living, and it's, were you just, living, just one second, one second, yeah. Were you living in a council flat or private dwellings? I, I, I believe it was a private uh, rented by the council. So why, why can't you then go back to Acton? and try to yeah, find a local landlord. You what cannot is, get it. You what is the problem? It. No, no, they are managing the family's affairs. <laughs> they are hey, the ones you know what? Hey, yeah. Okay, brother, thank you very much. I think he... Uh, what, what try he, not to stress. Yeah, yeah. Try not to stress, young man. Yeah. The future is going to be good. Don't worry. And, and there will be... Uh, the, you, your matters would be passed to people. And I think he... Councillor Nisar Malik himself, even though he is from Hansler, is a local politician who has a heart for the people. He will listen. I think it's an ac unacceptable that the mother, yourself, the ill dad, and your daughter, uh, your sisters are all suffering, thrown out far away. Do you Cheer, have I think his address? He, yeah, yeah. Do we have his address? Uh, I think, yes, I if have he, his if address. He, if he leaves you with the studio, Definitely, yes, please. Yeah. Um, but I can, I, can, I, can, I can feel your stress. Yeah, definitely. But you mustn't stress. Mm -hmm. Stress is a very bad thing, son. Yeah, definitely. Thank you okay. very much. Yeah. Uh, I think we, we have to uh, do a little bit advert, please. Uh, the, the technician, we are asking uh, an advert. See, this is, this, is, this is the incompetence. Yeah, definitely. This and I'm not blaming the councillors. Yeah, yeah. I'm blaming the system. Yeah. The system mm -hmm. does not work to help the public. Yeah, definitely. The system is wrong. Yeah. Yeah. And that's what needs change, mm. is the system. We have Councillor Nisar Malik, and we have a lot of people who have been in the past, and we have a lot of people who have been in the Head of a Resident Association and Business, and we have a lot of people who have been in the past, and we have a lot of أو قيبتي نقل قيب قاتي وحان لجوجا يوسف ولكن يوسف جولد أو كم إذا لذلك يجو كنال دجان كايلين يساتل وحبذا لنا لسه شقي ورد السم فلكا ولا يوسف كسر دواء محا إنه شيء كرتا حالة نلاش أي كسرين ذلك سومالي بدن بعد شقيين معي كمسل وال وال section of Eileen and the Muda Der Kishikin Jirni Eileen Council Wahyala Badan Samma Wahyala Old O Mele 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 Bae Nukot Sir Maanta Iyo Horan Merkel Usko Egana Ari Maha Maha Waha Usko Do Iyo Waha Usko Matari Kara Maha Olu Hada Ad Bae U Adagi Hien Dat Kodan Bae Ku Adagi Hien Marka Marka Dat Kodan Ay Ku Adagi Hien Asetan So Maale Da Hada Sikha Saane Ou Si Adagi Hien ما دام ما أنت دا كنسل أو باه ما أنت إنه هو الكاسو كش أو كنسل كاد كاد مدة سنة ولا حتى سنة يسات خوف كي يكون بيتك واحد من حياة مال أي تي نوها ولا شو مال ده مال واقص سدا واقص ونتي خوف كم عليه يكون بيتك كأقل واحد مالك تاي ديب واحد بس مركا لبر كوحة لو تلاقي له ديسادفانج كومينتي كا مركا خوف كده أنا مركو لو قد مالك تاي أول ده هو نيو أرايفل قد أنا لو قد هذا أنا أي أسي حجر marka asigu computerka waa latest technology lagu talagalay maartay wadanka adduunka hormaray lagu leeyahay 
marka si marka u eerto waxaan maxaa dhaysaa waa deliberate loogu talagalay disadvantage people to put it off of the service ya ay soo noqotaa mar gaafir qof saaks uu imaado wax yar uu shay yar uu imid oo maanta dhan meesha fadho ya ay horaan ha jiray front service oo loogu talagalay qofka go maada la caawiyo waraaqo go talaga saar turjumaan loo raadiyay hadda qofka computer ka wax u dhaxay maal computer ka hadda qof u heesho system ka waa la adkay ad ba loo adkay marka oo li waan isku wareeg ba ku jirta laakiin si marka uu eegto deliberate oo loogu talagalay dadka disadvantage kan waarta ma in my own experience every house every household na martay marka human contact ma jiro ma jiro whatever housing ka you have there's no way you can get human contact when you come for the front desk in the cancer okay maxuu yahay marka mashaakilaadka kale oo jira marka mashaakilaadka kale meel walba yaan meel walba ku seesa dhinaca iskuulka marka aad hawsho way adag tahay goes dhinaca iskuulka aad ilma aan da chief asa jiraan behavior ba iska jiraan ilma yar xanuunsan ba jiraan ilmi marka xanuunsan social ka soo gali social meel uu soo galo soo maalada maxaa u qabaan ba ilmi ba in laga qaadanaa ده أقولك أول ده هاي نجي هذا يسوى على جبودة ما ما هذا نقول لكم ما كابنا مع ده المهر ده على اللي قاعدني ما كا بيبل على فريد ما ما بها ما هو بقناي هو بقناي بق صافي سكوت هكا أنت اللي رادينها وحده هذا نوصي عاد كذا بيبقى سي بقاي دين على سوشيال بلاج مركب ما إيش إن ده عاد ما نحبس ك يه ده عاد سو ما له هذا محلك هو نمبر حبيت يا ده هذا سو مال ده تينيش كايو مركا يكتو وأكو بدن هاي فران هاي جرتي مالك هاي ما ينور تجرب بلدي جرا أو بدن كرايم كايو واحد بريسون تكجر هذا مركا سو يكتو محدا محا وارن كرتا ولا بحب سو أنا سو مال ده هسا ده مركا وحكا هذا الشيء إن دينا عاها أي ده أي ده أو معناها إن إن جرين دخل راح له أو سيستم كده بقى لوسو علي كمبيوترات وحكى لو كان هذا الشيء سكولات كين مشاكل كجرو وحكى لو كان شدتك وين بقت يمكن نقول هنا سوتشال كاد لو بقدو إن وحد تري وكل واحد جرد اللي يرفع ربضنا زائدة أو كجرت جالسها أوكي محاكى لو هو عدلة ده هاي إيلين إن دب واي هاي دك شو مال ده وي وي هستا شو مال ده أنت بضن دب كذا أيها سكول ده وريد جهان وما رك تاي the right advice يا مس أغلت كا كهبان مارك تاي أرتا سيدك جرام بابا أدقبا سيد كهران بس إنفورميشن إسبابا مارك واحد كل شو حريرهم حروا أغلت كأهرة أو ماشي واحد كو توصينا إن هذا صح لكن أي جالس كده وريجن ساعة ساعة قبل ستة تقرأ أنا بريسا قف ما قل واحد أنت اللي وريجنا يو يهوش بس يقرأني صح أوكي ما تسمع تاي إن بريا Councillor Nisar Malik, I think he, we have joined. We have been joined by uh, one of the long-term residents, Yusuf. Assalamu alaikum. Uh, brother Yusuf is is engaged with a lot of uh, community works, uh, a lot of organisations that involve with the community, and he mentioned a number of issues that are affecting the Somalis. He said. Uh, the, it's very difficult to get uh, a form of human contact. Many services that, that usually that uh, that usually were run by individuals are now run by uh, computers. The lack of human contact has complicated the situation. He said uh, there are schools, immense problems in these schools in Ealing. People are afraid of the systems. He said if they have problems, they are too afraid of social workers. Uh, they are afraid their children being taken. A lot of Somalis, uh, there is a growing number of, of, of Somali children in prisons. And uh, he said Somalis are not communicating enough with the, with the, the right department. It means they are just, uh, they gave up the hope, they are just uh, trying to talk to themselves about their problems. There is, in that way, in the ما دب ودب وانا هم بس ده هم كوشة دب كده تكون أنا وحاستها لكن when we are new beginner and we are disappointed with the language yeah and then the way of doing things is a high tech technology meant for the developed world then the the the, the master of the people is with the computer mm -hmm. and there's no way 
uh, the people they have other things to do. You can see the, the whole family is spending days and you know, m you know, weeks looking for simple issue uh, for going around the, the council. And on top of that, then we have housing issues, which is always very complex. Yeah. And the problem we have with the housing issue is, whenever you go to the representative people, whether they are councillors or the MPs, and you go for an issue, mm -hmm. you know the issues again, the housing issues, uh, the, the degree of, of complicity mm -hmm. varies. Mm -hmm. Then when you go, the first thing the MP come to, to tell you is, oh, we have a waiting list over 3,000, no, 30,000. Certain you cost certain is the advantage. Then if you go, yeah, I know, but this is a it's a genuine issue. If you say then, oh, the Somali alone we have such a number. Mm -hmm. So there's no way you can convince the councillor mm -hmm. to the blight of the vulnerable people. So, America had the ad we did so trahado in housing problem. I just that can go in his time. Halule waiting list. Waiting list. I have to cancel the doctor. Waiting list. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. I think he our matter to high level. Councillor. Nizar Malik, I think uh, the, the brother is here to uh, highlight some of the problems people go through, not only necessarily in Ealing alone, but um, almost uh, yeah, everywhere. everywhere. Uh, but we come back to uh, how do you think uh, the Labour Party as a party would address all the problems the brother has highlighted, the replacement of uh, employees with, with machines, a uh, machine is taking pla the, the place of the human being, which has become a norm at the moment. Uh, problem is that these schools, uh, people instead of having confidence in the systems, people becoming too afraid. I think he, uh, the prison issue, the, a lot of youngsters are going to prison. Uh, simply, they are coming from broken families. Uh, some of them are going because there is no opportunities for them to work. Uh, I think he, and when you highlight the problems like housing, you get a common answer. Uh, there is a long list of waiting. Uh, there is no hope for you, things like that. As a labor politician, what do you think would address these problems? <coughs> First thing yes. is obviously if, if the big multinationals, yes. the banks, yeah. the big institution, they made a mess of the the economy. Yes. And who is picking up the bill? Yeah. Is the poor people. Yes. If I run a business uh -huh. and if my bank lends me money, uh -huh. and if I don't run the business properly, uh -huh. they'll bankrupt me. Yeah. I'll say you can't run the business. Uh -huh. We're closing you down. Uh -huh. The big organization could not run the business properly. Mm -hmm. You look in America, the housing crisis, how they were lending the money. Mm -hmm. You look at here, how they were lending the money. 100% mortgages, no question asked. All those things mm -hmm. which the whole project of they were driving, mm -hmm. both sides of the Atlantic, yes. it went pear shape. Mm -hmm. But who is going to pay for it? Mm -hmm. It is the poor people. Yes. And this is what the Labour Party is saying, mm -hmm. that you got to increase the taxation mm -hmm. in order to pay for essential services. Mm -hmm. Essential services are housing, mm -hmm. education, mm -hmm. medicines, mm -hmm. all of those things which is actually matters to everyday people like this gentleman here. Mm -hmm. But if you're not building your houses, mm -hmm. where are you going to find properties to put these people in. Mm -hmm. We are committed, the Labour Party, to build 200,000 houses every year. Mm -hmm. This is to cut down the shortage of the housing, rather than separating the families, mm -hmm. rather than actually creating the creating problem. Head. You send these, these families and, and young people mm -hmm. who actually don't even know the area, yes. they don't even have <coughs> any connection, mm -hmm. they have no friends, no relatives, nothing. Mm -hmm. Just for the sake of economics, mm -hmm. they are being driven out of London, mm -hmm. out of the places where they have all their relationships, friends and everything, mm -hmm. 
it is because of the Tory party's policies yeah. where they're actually separating the families, yes. friends. Yeah, breaking the unit. Breaking the units. Yeah. And this is where I say mm -hmm. the Labour Party is still relevant yes. because we want to build the houses. Mm -hmm. We want to make sure that we keep the people in a place yeah. where they can actually enjoy their lives yes. and have a living standard yeah. which people can actually who do you think has actually introduced yeah. the minimum pay yeah. who do you think is introduced the national health who do you think actually asked uh, for, for uh, women to vote mm -hmm. all these things is done by the Labour Party uh, which we enjoy today I understand the Labour Party is not doing too well, but I say to your viewers, the Labour Party is still the party for poor, mm -hmm. and still for the party who wants to actually uh, uh, do something with the poor. Yeah. You will never get this from the Tory party. Let me say that to you. Yeah, definitely. Uh, well, I have iyadoo iskuulaadkii dhibaatooyinka taagan yihiin iyadoo Soomaali fara badan ay macnaha ay sheegayaan in sida loola tacaamulo qaasatan social services ka ay abuurtay baqatin dadku ay ka baqanayaan ba aruurta in laga qaato waxa kale iyo iyada soo korodhay tirada aruurta Soomaaliga ay galeysa jeelasha ee marka waxa ay aan si guud u iri maxa ala oo waxaan lagu xallin karaa marka kaamsala Nizar Maalik waxa uu yiri hadii aan adigu aan macnaha wadaya ganacsi oo aan anigu ganacsi bilaabaya maanahayo bangigu wuxuu siinaya ee lacag buu siinaya hadii aanan si fiican u wadin ganacsigaasi hadda waxay noqonaysaa in lacagti laga doona ama la geliyo bankrupt state aanan waxba aanan awoodin beena iska bixiyo marka hay'adaha waaweyn macnaha ee waxa ay ay macnaha u wadaan ganacsiga si markaasi aanan haboonayn labourku waxa uu leeyahay waxa uu kor u qaadaya taxation ka anshuuraha macnaha la qaado anshuuraha la bixiyo si markaasi awood ugu yeesho ee macnaha in adeegyada daruuriga ah dadku u baahan yihiin sida waxbarashada caafimaadka housing ka markaasi awood loo yeesho in dadka la gaarsiiyo وعو يري معناها وحن معناها كميتد نهاي اما مخلصين كان اي ان ان ديسي دونا الا لابا بقلو كن او قري سنة كستا معناها وحو يري يهي احايان داد كي كان اي اد اما لاي نايسا مينيمم ويج كا يهي احايان داد كي هوين هوين كو ان عود بحيان وحا صدان وحاي هاد شاقا ليبر كو او قبتاي این کاستو دیباتوی این لیبر که هستو ولی وحنا های حزب معنا رелیفنت آو جرا و ولی ای حبان تهدت کو اینه او ارکان سیده او ارک جرین عدل که ایولیه برنامج که آن سوگار نی جب جب دی سوحان سینه نه فرصت آ کل سو حریری کردن تحقق تلفن که خاطر فرنجی حالا یوسف محقق دریسا on the issue of what we are talking at the moment is local issues. Uh. All these are dealing on the on the excuse of the cuts, but we understand these are local issues. We know some barras controlled by the uh, Labour Party now they have surplus money in uh. their account. Uh -huh. They have the surplus money on their account. Well this is going on. In Ealing? In Ealing especially. Okay. How, how that, uh, that actually, I, 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 have, I can't comment on it. Yeah, you can. Maybe. I'll have a barras as well. I'll have a barras as well. So, <coughs> that is one issue. And the other thing is this n n notion of saying we'll build more housing. Mm -hmm. Tony Blair used to sing a long time ago. So, if he has done enough yeah. that time, maybe this, uh, th this, this service could have been elevated mm -hmm. to, some, to some extent. Mm -hmm. The other issue is... This when the uh, the Labour Party allowed the European people to come to UK that time, long time ago, by Tony Blair. <coughs> that also was a big mess. So the Labour Party need to, need to answer a lot of questions. Okay, we have got another discussion. We have a discussion with the Council. We have a Councillor Mali closing speech. I give you the last uh, one minute of the program. Uh, it's Thank you. Here. Thank you very much. First of all, let me say this, uh, we 
live in this country where we have different issues than from where we come from. Yes. And I think the people who are <coughs> living back home, they have a lot more worse than what we have here. Yeah. Let's just remember this. Yeah. Secondly, I would say for for Somalian community and other communities, please, please pay attention to your children. Make sure you treat them and you look after them and you spend time with them. Because if you are busy in your own life, and I am talking now particularly the fathers. Yeah. Fathers needs to give time. It's not just a mother's duty. Yeah. I brought up three children and I know that the amount of time I spent with them, sat with them doing a homework, taking for a play, going around to make sure that they actually know everything what is going on around the world and know what they're going on in the, in, in the area. Education, education and education. Very important and you can only do that if you're going to help the mother to raise the children. If you're going to leave the mother and go away and do your own thing, and the poor woman has got three children or two children or four children to look after, how is she going to manage? What are they going to end up? So please make sure that you educate, you look after your children, so they become a good citizen when they grow up. Mm -hmm. And as far as uh, politics is concerned, I say the Somalian community, they need to come out and be part of a politics whether it is a school governess, yeah. whether they are counselors, whether they are social workers, or whatever they like to do, they need to come out, particularly when we are making policies. Yeah. And policies mean that we, as a counselors, make the policy, yeah. officers implement it. Yeah. If you've got a good counselors, they can make sure they implement the policies. And take your views yeah. into the table. Yeah, absolutely. Okay. أولا يا الله حنسو قرني قبل قبل دي برنامج ككابسل النسار مالي وحسو جديدي إن تلدي سوق الدم بيسي إن صمالي ذا واجب يكون تعين السياسة دا سوق لان أو مركزي هدي أي جيران كابسل الرم مركزي صمالي ذا كسو جيدا وحيك قيب قادن كران قام هذا الجار يو السياسة دا هاللجان جوني إن إنتي يعني سجل صلاة بندونا مستقبل كده وحد لأن هاي أمانة الله يا أمانة الرسول يسارك تدم بي أوحي سلام عليكم السلام دمانتين خير يا بركاتي رجيني